I think that Bernie Madoff should go to jail for the rest of his life and pay for what he did to, to these people. I think it's a tragedy. I think it's, a, it, it, you, have to, you have to understand that here was, a, here was an individual when a tragedy occurred in a family, went to the funeral. If somebody caught a cold and he knew about it, a phone call would come. Here's an individual that was always accessible by telephone. If you called him, you always received a, a, a telephone call in, in, in return. Uh, when my wife's uh, sister passed away, Bernie, Mad Bernie Madoff came to the funeral. That's the type of individual that we all thought he was, a very caring individual when all he was was a first-class crook. Oh, I don't know why he did it. I think like any other crook. Uh, this was a Ponzi scheme, a very clever Ponzi scheme. I spoke to Bernie. I, there was a conference call of his, of his foundation that I was on j just last week. Uh, and he was very jovial and very happy. I had spoken to him on the telephone a week before. He mentioned a couple good movies that he had seen. He had a great reputation, and uh, he was respected. He was president of NASDAQ, a consultant to the Securities and Exchange Commission, all those things. He had every, 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 he had every single pedigree that you could possibly imagine, um, and, and, I, and, I, and I had confidence in him. Personally, I, I went. I remember meeting him, calling him. I went to New York uh, to, to meet him, and I met him f frequently uh, after that. I mean, we had dinner together. Um, I'm on his foundation, one of his foundation that he has an interest in as well, and I've given substantial dollars to that foundation. Um, that's the type of confidence that all of these individuals had in them. I don't think you'll find anybody that will say anything else to you other than what I have. There was no suspicion of it, none. I mean, we received, uh, we, we received rafts of information uh, of supposed trades uh, that, were, that, 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 were, that obviously were, were fiction. My concern has been for a number of people that I know personally who have lost everything. I mean, there's, there's one 98-year-old woman living in Miami that depended upon the income uh, that she received from Bernie Madoff for the people that take care of her every day. And the people who dealt with Madoff were not the greedy ones. The people that dealt with Madoff were interested in preserving capital and earning a minimal return on their investment. It's the scam of the century. It's a Ponzi scheme. And, uh, and Madoff has just hurt so many, so many innocent people who really didn't deserve to be hurt, just people who trusted him.